Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your girl Sandy, and you can see Matt Chambers. I know y'all are so excited to see him again on my video, and I'm excited to have him as my my guest videographer for today. How you doing, Matt? I'm doing good. I'm Vesty McVesterson today. I got the I like the look. I'm liking the look. Thank you for being my videographer today, sir. My pleasure. My All pleasure. right. So we're doing my third episode of Sandy Style Files. I'm going to show you guys um, an outfit, a few outfits, variations of some outfits featuring thrifted pieces. So we're going to go ahead and like switch it. positions. And it's I'm a big pass trend over these days, right? You got to thrift. I know. You've got to be thrifty. I know. Okay. All right. So here we go. All right. What's up, y'all? How y'all doing? Okay. So as promised, I got a lot of requests from you guys for my next episode of Sandy Style Files to start incorporating some of the thrifted pieces that I got from uh, the last couple of times that I went thrifting. Now, a lot of you guys have not seen um, any of the pieces I got that were more of the blouses. I got pretty much I want to say it was what 15 or 16 blouses, like three belts, and a blazer, all for $69 total. Okay. Now, hopefully, I can try to incorporate some of these blouses. I'm going to show you guys a few looks with some of the blouses that I got at the thrift store, and this was at the Goodwill. Okay. Each of these blouses I'm going to feature in this series were two dollars. Okay. So um, anyway, we're going to incorporate that within this segment. Hope you guys enjoy. Like I said, as always, let me know down below what you guys think. Let me know if you guys have any other suggestions of things you want me to incorporate in Sandy Style Files. I hope you guys are enjoying the series thus far and let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so here we go. Um, first and foremost, we've got the thrifted item as you guys can see hopefully. This is my thrifted item of the day. This is actually a blouse I got at Goodwill and it is too cute and once again two dollars okay two dollars like I said I got about 15 or 16 work blouses and three belts and a blazer all for $69 total okay now y'all know that's hard to do now cute top okay it's pretty much on camera when I was shooting today um, it looked like it was kind of polka dot but it's they're more squares with little circles on the inside but the cool thing I love about it it's got this ruffle here very modern it's this is actually an older um, shirt but very modern look to it what I did because this top is actually a 14 a size 14 16 now I don't wear a 14 I'm more like an 810 but what I did just to kind of um, cinch my waistline because it is a little big on me I wore it with this belt this belt you've seen before in an outfit previous to this this is actually from BB I've had this belt for at least three four years okay I'm wearing a Belova watch and it needs a new battery <laughs> um, I'm wearing my wedding ring and this is actually a ring from uh, Forever 21 I've had this for a while and the skirt that I'm rocking today I want to go a little sexy a little vampy today vampy sexy but conservative this is actually from BB as well I've had this skirt it's a pencil skirt I've had this skirt for probably as long as I've had the belt at least three four years so, all right so here is the outfit now I'm gonna show you guys the shoes I don't know if my feet are ashy y'all I'm just gonna be real <laughs> with y'all for real I had Uggs on earlier but I brought my shoes now I stubbed my toes so I messed up my pedicure, but we're going to show hopefully this foot. This is actually a shoe from, um, this is an Enzo Angiolini shoe. I got this from Hot Look. The link for Hot Look is down below. So anyway, this is the outfit, y'all, and it features, like I said, a $2 thrifted blouse. Y'all can't beat that. So. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this outfit. Hopefully you guys got a good look at something kind of different. It's conservative. It's a, it's a little little sexy, conservative, okay? It covers up everything. Great for work. It's also a great little outfit if you're just going to grab some brunch or whatever the case, okay? That is outfit number one. And next up, we're going to go into outfit number two. What's up, y'all? Your girl, Sandy. Okay, we're on outfit number two. Just so you guys know, I'm a little frazzled, so I don't even know what I look like right now. I've got Matt on the ones and twos behind the scenes doing the video for me. Thank you, Matt. Okay, this is my next outfit. This actually features another thrifted blouse. And this is similar to that yellow blouse I showed you guys in another video prior to this. This is, yet again, $2, okay? You can't beat that. Has a more secretary chic look. Um, like I said, real similar to the yellow top that I showed you guys in my last video. And I'll use an annotation so I can show you guys what that video looks like because that was another work outfit of the day featuring a thrift outfit. I also wore it with my Drew Fit pants. I love the Drew Fits. These are from The Limited. These are actually a um, gray and black pant okay and they are really thick nice thick 
pants that are great for this time of year. It's really, really cold right now. And I'm just rocking it out with um, this watch here that I actually got from one of my wonderful good girlfriends who has a jewelry, um, a jewelry line. That link is in the description box if you guys want to check out these watches. I have a ring from Forever 21 right here and my wedding ring as usual. And oh, my shoes. These are the same shoes you guys saw in my last outfit. These are just comfortable. That's why I rock them a lot. I have these earrings from Forever 21 and these are just black and silver. And that's about it. I've got Ruby Woo on my lips, Revlon Color Stay on my face, and the usual Studio Fix powder in NW45. That's about it. So if you want to pan up and down and show the outfit, again, you can't beat a $2 thrifted blouse. You can't beat that. Very comfortable, totally suitable for work, very conservative, but still very, very chic. So anyway, hopefully you guys love this outfit. Hope you enjoy it. Let me know which outfit you like so far in this video series the best, and we're gonna go ahead and move on to the next one. All right, you guys, we're on outfit number three. Now, like I said, each of these outfits are going to feature at least one thrifted item, and it's pretty much been the case so far this week. This is my third outfit, and this is basically what it is. It is a vest and a very sheer top along with some black pants, and these are my usual Drew Fits by The Limited, and these are my staple black heels. The top, the actual top, the purple top is from the thrift store. This is from the Goodwill. It is a beautiful sheer purple top and the whole top is sheer. By the way, thank you so much, Matt. Matt has been shooting these for me all week. He's been amazing. So I want to make sure <laughs> to say that. So tell everyone, make sure you guys comment below and tell him you did an amazing job. Okay. So anyway, this is the sheer top. It's got some detail here on the... Um, on the sleeve here, and surprise, my hands are ashy, so I apologize. I keep washing them throughout the day, so I'm letting you know that now. Okay, um, put a vest over it just because it is sheer, and I wanted to kind of make it conservative, very sim very simple, something to do for work, and I thought it worked out really well. Okay, and I'll kind of show you what the bottom part of it looks like, although I can't show you the mid part of it because uh, you see my bra. Okay, that's basically how sheer it is. So you guys can kind of see that, okay? It's very sheer. The whole thing is ruffled throughout, okay? All the way to the top, and it is a V-neck top. And what I basically did, like I said, was put a vest over just to kind of camouflage the fact that it is sheer up here, okay? And put a piece here. This is actually from one of my um, good girlfriend's jewelry lines. Her link will be in the description box as well. This is one of her pieces, and she creates these from scratch. It's the same girl who did the um, Swarovski crystal watches that I featured on my channel before. Um, I just put a couple of bangles, real simple bangles. I can't double up on them because they um, will hit each other and make noise on the microphone. And I have this ring. You guys already know my hands are ashy. I already told y'all. That's a ring from Forever 21. I've had it forever. My wedding ring as usual. And that's it. I went purple on the lips and I've got all my purple life and I forgot oh bust out is the under color uh, they're both Mac products and I'll put those in the description box as well other than that this is the whole outfit I wanted to show you guys the outfit that I rocked out today featuring a thrifted item and the purple top is the thrifted item okay so like I said let me know down below what outfit you guys like so far and we've got one more outfit to go what's up guys all right this is the last and final look and this is again featuring at least one thrifted item and so far all the ones that I've featured have been one item each so anyway I wanted to show you guys some of the things that I got in my latest thrift haul we're at back here in the sports area it's a little junky in this area so I apologize for that we just had some breaking news about Albert Pujols of the cards for those of you guys in St. Louis or the big baseball fans whatever anyway all right, so here it is. The thrifted item that I'm wearing today is this green sweater, and it is freaking freezing outside, okay? Matt's on the ones and twos again, and he's been reporting freaking cold, cold, <laughs> cold weather. So I'm rocking out a sweater that I got from the Goodwill, okay? Got this on the same trip that I got all the other blouses that I featured in this series, okay? And this actually was $3, 3 or $4 if I'm not mistaken. I'll use an annotation and let you know if I'm incorrect, okay? Either way, it's cheaper than I would have gotten it if I had gotten it at the stove, like the Gap or whatever. Now, I love turtlenecks, especially turtlenecks that are warm like this. So it is very, very warm. And the sleeves almost hit me where they should. So what I'm doing is just rolling them up like so. And I'm just giving myself a little bit of dimension because on camera, when you're wearing big sweaters like this, it makes you look really, really super bulky. So I just tied a belt around it just to give me a little dimension so it doesn't look so, so big on me, okay? And it's just a black belt that I got from one of my suits that I have at home, okay? And I'm rocking it out with a pair of pants I got from the Limited. 
and these are just some khaki color pants very very comfortable okay and rocking out my usual shoes this is the shoes I've been featuring the entire time during this series I also have just got some gold hoops on from forever 21 my usual Revlon color stay on my face um, I will use an annotation right here to tell you what the lipstick is that I have on and nothing else major really just mascara usual highlight whatever but anyway oh and the ring I got from forever 21 okay and that's it y'all like this is literally just a really inexpensive way to rock out some uh, to actually find some pieces for work or for play or whatever so this is the whole outfit so hope you guys have enjoyed it so far you all have to let me know what y'all think what outfit you guys like the best so far I showed you a couple of really super casual looks and a couple of looks that are great for work that are a little bit dressier but still conservative so anyway Anyway, that's it for my series. I hope you guys like this episode of Sandy Style Files. And again, let me know down below and uh, if you guys have any ideas of other things that you want me to style. I've been keeping track of all the requests my way. Just leave your comments down below. And that's about it. As always, follow me on Twitter, twitter.com forward slash socialitesandy. And of course, friend me on Facebook, facebook.com forward slash the socialite life. And of course, follow my blog. I've got some new stuff on my blog, so make sure you guys follow it, the socialitelife.blogspot.com. And as always, I love y'all, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.